Good afternoon, Panthers. This is Coach Young. I'm reporting from my apartment. I just hope that everybody out here is washing their hands properly, practicing social distance, distancing like we should be. Um, today, what Coach Young has done is I'm going to post the workout for you guys to do this week as part of your physical ed education activity. Um, I know I have not been at the school very long, but I just want to let you guys know how much Coach Young misses walking around the, the building and seeing you guys' faces. I hope this ends soon so that we're able to return back to some type of normalcy. Today, what we're going to do for our activity is called a HIT workout. HIT is H-I-I-T, uh, High Intensity Interval Workout. What we're going to do is we're going to do a series of different movements. We're going to give maximum effort in those movements and then there's going to be little rest in between. We have four movements that we're going to do today just so you guys get used to doing a HIIT workout. After the end of those four movements, we're going to give 20 second rest. After that 20 second rest, we're going to start again for the, the next round. Coach Young is going to record one round for you to do on your own. The last two rounds you all will do and I'm going to see about uh, giving uh, the students an opportunity to post their activity onto our YouTube page. One of the reasons why Coach Young loves HIIT workouts is as you see here, all I have is a mat. I have a jump rope. Um, I have this bench here for one of the movements that we're going to do. But HIIT workouts are great because they require no equipment. They can be done anywhere. As you see, I'm doing this from my apartment. So I want you guys to, to get used to doing HIIT workouts because what I pose for you guys to do as an activity is gonna feature a lot of HIIT workouts because they're a great way to get your fitness level up and they can be done anywhere. So before we begin, as you guys know, if you were coming into the gym right now, you guys will be doing your warm ups before we get started. I want to keep everything as normal as possible. So just like if we were going to the gym, I want everybody to find personal space. As you see, I've cleared out some stuff in, in my living room, so I'm not bumping into anything. Remember, stretch your arms out. This exercise, guys, I want you to remember, you can call your brother, your sister, mom or dad for any of the teachers that are watching. If you'd like to do the hit inter interval workout, again, you can uh, take part of this as well. So. First thing we're gonna do, guys, remember we're gonna do small arm circles. Going forward on the count of 10, ready, begin. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. All right, we're gonna do 10 arm circles going backwards, starting now. One, two, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. All right, now we're going to have a seat on the floor. Coach Young has a little issue with his knee, so I have this uh, pad right here. All right, remember we're going to stretch our legs out, try to touch our toes. We're going to hold it for a count of 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I want you to leave your left foot forward, take your right knee back, reach out, touch your toes, hold it for a count of 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Stretch your right leg out, take your left foot back, same thing. Touch your toes, hold it for a count of 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. All right, take your left foot and your right foot back. We're gonna do butterflies. Hold it for a count of 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. All right, at this time, Panthers, you all know normally Coach Amy, Coach Young, will have you guys do a few laps around the gym just to get that heart rate going. But because again, we're modifying everything, and we don't have the ability to necessarily go run. If you're doing this workout by yourself, this will be a great time for you to pause, 
you can do, go do a, a few laps or what we're going to do as part of this warm up is Coach Young loves to jump rope. If you don't have a jump rope, again, I'm showing you how to do modified movements as well. You do not have to have a jump rope. You can do the jump rope movement. So you're going to do jump rope for just a, a few moments. Again, all we're trying to do is get that heart rate up before we get started into our actual activity. So I'm going to grab my jump rope. And guys, remember, you don't have to do anything fancy. Just a basic jump rope. All we want to do, we're trying to get that heart rate going. The way Coach Young likes to do jump rope is I like to do it like, like boxers. They have a little, a little skip when they do their when they do their jump. If you want to, you can try to do double unders. If you want to, you can try to cross. Again, I'm not trying to do anything other than get my heart rate going. Panthers, just so you know, Coach Young is being recorded today by his assistant, Mrs. Young. She can't see you right now, but she says hello to the Panthers. I haven't done anything in a while. So, Coach Young got the jump rope caught on his foot. But you know what? We're still out here. We're still going to keep trying. We're going to still keep working. We're getting that heart rate up. I'm going to pick it up a little bit now. is up I definitely feel like I'm working so we're gonna get to the actual hit workout so to begin our series of, of workouts first thing we're gonna do is 50 push-ups or at least that's what my goal is so I want the Panthers to get down find the space underneath your couch you can go get a partner have them hold your feet have them sit on your feet I'm gonna tuck my feet underneath our couch. We're gonna lay back, put our hands behind our head. If you wanna fold them and interlock them, you can. Again, Coach Young is gonna do 50 sit-ups. I want my Panthers to try to do at least 20. For those that wanna keep up with Coach Young, you can keep up with Coach Young. 50 sit-ups, starting now. One, two, three. getting back. 45, 46, 47, 48, 
Panthers, the next thing we're going to do is 30 push-ups. I have the mat here. If it makes it easier for you to do your push-ups on, if you don't want the mat, you don't have to the, have the mat. When I do my push-ups, it hurts my wrist to do push-ups when my hands are flat. So a lot of times when you see Coach Young in the gym or any place else doing push-ups, I do it on my knuckles because it's more comfortable. So again, we're going to get ready and place ourselves in push-up position, get up in a plank position. I'm going to do mine on my knuckles. We're going to go 30. For all my Panthers, I want you guys to do at least 10. If you want to keep up with Coach Young, you can. 30 push-ups begin now. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. All right. Now, Panthers, the next thing we're going to move over to are called tricep dips. I have the bench for my kitchen table here that I'm going to do mine with. You can do this on a chair. What you're going to do is position yourself on the bench the way Coach is doing here. Put your feet out. And you're just going to do a slow dip down and come back up. We're ready to begin now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, Panthers. The last activity in our HIIT workout is called a burpee. These are difficult, but these can be a lot of fun if you put your all into it. So here's the movement of a bur burpee. This is what we're going to do. First thing with the burpee, you're going to jump up. You're going to go down, kick your feet out, kick your feet back in, and jump up. up. We're going to do 30 second burpees beginning now. Now. Time. All right, Pan Panthers, that's 30 second burpees. That's our four movements. We're going to take a 20 second break and then we're going to get in round two. Coach Young is going to continue on finishing the se second part or the second round without you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this workout. You can do this on your other PE days this week. Wednesday and Friday. This is Coach Young signing off. Panthers, be safe.